Um, there's a big uh, consumer technology conference in Vegas called uh, CES. And one of the things that we saw, we actually saw a video of this, is a robot that is doing I physical know. exercise called parkour, which Nuts. is based on military obstacle course training. <laughs> so you look at this clip and you think, I've seen this movie before and it yes. does not end well. No, it's creepy. But the deeper question here Can is... Can you travel back in time? It, it, you, know, <laughs> you know, this is a, it's a subject that starts with drones, uh. but... It, it raises the very serious issue, which is if robots are going to do our fighting in the future, war may be treated a lot differently. One of the one of the things that prevents a lot of wars is that older people don't like it when their sons and daughters are placed in harm's way, right. and young people don't like getting shot at. Mm -hmm. So if you have drones and robots doing all the fighting for you, does that lower our inhibitions about war and make war more likely? There are a lot of ethical questions mm -hmm. raised by this uh, very alarming little piece of video. They always just look just a little creepy. Yeah, and if it yeah. starts to talk and it says, come with me if you want to live, <laughs> <laughs> run. <Right. laughs>